What's up, ladies and gents? Sinistrino 1, your host, and welcome back to more Assassin's Creed Odyssey. So, first of all, thank you to Ubisoft, obviously, for allowing me to play this game for you guys. It is now officially released, so hopefully you're out there playing, having fun. So, I've got a different type of video. Yes, this is the same walkthrough that we're doing, but I'm actually recording this via my new Avery Media Live Gamer 4K. So let me know if you see any problems so that I can get them fixed in this video, or should I say after this video. Uh, so if you see anything out of the norm, let me know if you think it looks better. Uh, just, you know, let me know what you see. Audio problems, anything like that. Please let me know so we can get it taken care of as soon as we can. With that being said, it is time to do this main mission, Snake in the Grass. This is a very fun mission to do. And we're not too far from actually uh, where we need to be. So, one of the coolest things about this new Avery Media um, 4K... It's a PCIe, so it goes into the computer slot, so... But one of the coolest things is it allows me to actually be able to play this game in HDR. So I am playing this on my OLED 55-inch 4K HDR TV. But I'm able to record this to you guys in just regular SDR. So I don't have to worry about converting anything, it does it automatically, and I'm good to go. So please, by all means, let me know in the comments if you guys are seeing any problems. Hiding in plain sight. I really, really want to know, and I want to make sure that I get this the best that it can be. Quality is very important to me on this channel. You gotta find some ways to stick out, some ways to make yourself better, to better yourself. And quality for me is one of the biggest things I can do. I can't give you quality because I don't want to flood your inboxes. And, you know, I'm running two uh, double jobs here with YouTube and Facebook, so I try to give as much uh, quality as I can with everything that I do. So with this mission, we really only need to focus on him. You don't have to focus on anything else but him. So let's get started. We're going to go ahead and make our way inside. We're going to do this without being caught, of course. I should be extra careful in this area. Alright, so as I said, this should not be too difficult for you. It's very, very simple. This is not even where the main mission is going to be. I don't want to spoil too much, obviously. All we really got to focus on is getting to our guy. We're wanting to get in here, that way we can actually take him out. Wow, that did not go the way that I wanted to. I apologize, guys. This was not... I was not supposed to be seen there. I was so surprised that I was seen right there. But we're not caught just yet because we've isolated him. Good. Alright, so we're gonna get in. Grab him. Decoy. And go. Why am I not surprised? Alpinor! You coward! Alpinor knew I would come for him. 
Use that imposter to lure me into a trap. Your plan failed, Elpinor. Soon, you will join your imposter. So what happened was that this guy right here found the body. He actually went around. I was hoping that I would have hit it. I should have hit it better. That was my fault. I should have instead of just having it right here, maybe even thrown it over or something. But we're actually done in this area. So you just all, you could have done this without messing with anyone. But again, a little bit of uh, human error on my part. You can't be perfect when you're doing RPG games yeah. like these. It just doesn't work out that way. So right now what we're doing is we're going to head all the way back here and we need to go over to that point. We're going to have to get into a fight, obviously, and take him out. He kind of set us a trap. But we're smart enough. bit of a trekkie distance here, but it's not too bad. I mean, if you wanted to, if there is a viewpoint over close to here somewhere, you could probably end up just getting the viewpoint and then fast traveling so you don't have to do all of this here, but it's up to you guys. Sometimes it's nice to take a look at the world and travel around a little bit, but it can be also difficult because of the fact of, whoa, <laughs> wow, because of that right there. I'm surprised he's still alive. Aflac? And again, let me know if you guys see any blemishes, any problems at all. Let's... Okay, let's check this out. We've got a... Long distance to travel, but as you can see, there is another one of those right there, so... And it looks like there also is a viewpoint that we could have taken. Which actually might be the best option. Look how close that viewpoint is to where that is. So that's what we're going to do. Gives us a chance to show you guys a little bit of the fast travel system as well. There's a viewpoint right here. We can go ahead and use it. That's why it's very important to make sure you grab all those viewpoints as much as you can. But everything looks to be like it's running semi-decent so far. Hopefully it'll stay that way as we're testing out this new... Well, we're using a, a system called RecCentral, or should I say it's a um, an application that the Avery Media uses in order to record all of its gameplay. So. Hopefully everything, again, is working great. I, I made a new setup, so... Alright, so now we're close enough. We just need to turn around and... It's gonna be directly below us, it looks like. Death is coming for you, Alpinor. There he is. Now, normally you'd have to go through this little area right here, but we don't need to do that. We're going to try to get in this time stealthy without dealing with any of those guys. There is, however, one guard outside. So there's only one guard you got to mess with, so you got to figure out how we can... ...not deal with him, of course. Nikolaus warned me of snakes in the grass, but I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> Now, when fighting him, you are going to have to, like, you can't stealth him. They'll keep a sharp watch here. Do it. Still saw me. Nothing you can do. I've tried so many times to be able to not have to worry about this guy, but you just can't get him where you want him. Now 
And unfortunately, we got a lot more enemies that are coming. So let's let's get ourselves back out of the way. That's the only unfortunate thing. It's like where he's located. That's like it doesn't really allow you to grab him. We just couldn't get up fast enough. We'll let them get back into their whatever routine. Unfortunately, you can't drop on him from where we were before either. Like, if there was a way that we could get him out of that hole without having to be seen, then that would have been the best option. But we tried. When we climbed, we just didn't get high enough. He was still peripheral vision able to see us. So just let things die down a little bit. Okay, looks like they're all going to be slowly. This one, he's no longer alerted anymore. But we got to wait for this guy here. There he goes. All right. Now you see it's put us in the same exact situation. The other guy replaced him. So do you see the dilemma, right? What I'm going to try to do is something. Let's see if we can't... draw them out that way. Nice, that actually worked. What do you know? Now, see, if I would have known that before, that I could have used that arrow, then I wouldn't have had, we would have been able to stealth this a lot easier. See? You learn every single time you're playing, you keep learning. Now this, unfortunately, you can't go in there without him seeing you. We can get a lot of damage on him though. Let's see if we can't. Make him turn around a little bit though. I can smell that Malacca's stench. It doesn't really do a lot of damage, but. Shame. I would have made you rich before we killed you. Almost got him. Don't hide it. The cop always gets it. Watch. We already have demons. We'll find your mother and you'll be dead. Killing me is a mistake. Trusting you on Kefalonia was a mistake. I am the reason you left that island alive. The cult wanted you dead. What cult? Where are they? <laughs> I found on Elpinor is like nothing I've ever seen. Might come in handy. All 
All right, there you go. So let's go ahead and pick up our new torso. All right. Now this next quest is very, very heavily story oriented. So like I said, if we were just able to get in there, now I know I can use those arrows to actually bring them out of locations that you normally wouldn't, I don't they want normally to be wouldn't come here. out, so. Now, another good thing about this is we got more fast travel. So where we're actually going is pretty much right where we were. The only problem is you got to get out of a certain location before you can fast travel. Right now we're inside the snake's temple. So we just need to get out of here. And now we should actually be able to fast travel without any problems. So again, this next section is a very, very heavily story related, so spoilers, obviously. And I, it threw me for a loop as well, so I think they've done an amazing job so far with the story, and I'm really, really enjoying it. But of course, let me know what you guys think of the story so far. Are you playing Assassin's Creed right now? Have you downloaded it? Are you excited for the remaster for Assassin's Creed 3, which is coming next year? So even though we're not going to have a mainstream Assassin's Creed game, we're going to be getting that remaster, which is, I loved Assassin's Creed 3, because I'm a huge history buff. This is the secret chamber. They're not ones for subtlety, are they? So, this is it. Hidden chamber of the cultists. Here, all along. I'm going inside. Keep my clothes for me. Best not to go in with your weapons, either. I don't think they'll look too kindly on that. How do I look? Terrifying. Good. Find me once you've found out the truth in there. Keep your wits about you. Try not to do anything rash. Me? Rash? Who thought these ridiculous costumes were a good idea? Demos hasn't arrived yet. Sorry, it's my uh, first time. A new recruit? <gasps> welcome, welcome. There's a lot of people here. All share our common mind. Good. We're here to evaluate the strides taken by the cult since the last meeting. We haven't met for some, some time. Where did they come from? The land and across the seas, we assemble as a community. Here, there is no war. There are no sides. You mentioned someone. Vimos. Who is that? You'll learn her name very, very quickly. She's our leader. I'm sure she believes that, but no. She's our weapon. She's difficult, but she does important work for us. I don't envy her position one bit. 
I'll go talk to the others. Thank you. Yes, yes, before Demos comes. Who knows if you'll get a word in after that. Letters to and from the cult. Gods. They have a foothold in every part of the Greek world. We're in more danger than I thought. I'll need much more information to identify who these cultists are. All right, then. Heist. You're not listening. Forget the mother. She's useless. With what influence? My post gets me swayed many of the just one of the things that need to be for the father. A shipment of mud, yeah, it gets to the business of it. Pull yourself together, Malaka! You're a fucking pig before slaughter! I'll do it, I swear! I'll kill him! Let me go! You like to watch, you sick fuck! You're not just going to watch, you're going to teach this little insolent shit a lesson! Does he deserve it? Does it fucking matter, does it? What I say goes, no questions asked! I... I couldn't do it! But I'm not scared, not anymore! If you can't kill a fucking Archon, what are you gonna do when I tell you to kill a fucking Archon? I will, I will! I'll kill Fidias. I don't want it. Well, you fucking have to want it, cause I say so. Take it! No, I won't do it. <sighs> Give the coward another chance. Think he owes you something, you lucky bastard? You get to keep your skin today! He would have killed me. He's insane. Thank you. Stay off his bad side. I will. But he's right. I'll go straight to Athens. I won't fail ever again. I'm going to kill Fidias. Fuck up like that again and I'll draw blood! Now get the fuck out of here before I get this traitor's blood on your robes! You! Someone was spotted going into your house! Guards were found dead outside! Tell me who you talk to or I'll break your pretty face! Please! I beg you! He forced me! I thought he would kill me! So what we just did is something you can have changed. You necessarily you don't have to help him out. And he will actually get burned. It's up to you. You can make the choice again. So it can play out in many different ways. Specifically, that one was nothing happened to him, but we were able to learn who he's actually going after. I'm still not convinced. You. We need another opinion on this. Why split the resources searching for a woman we can't find? If we narrow our focus, Athens will be ours. Immediate threats have to be destroyed. Pericles has to be destroyed. Not without the mother. We aren't strong enough without the mother. Don't let Vimos hear that. If anything, we should be hunting the father. <sighs> we know who the mother is. Looking for the father would be a waste of resources. What do you think? Hunt the champion's mother or her father? Neither. You have a better idea. The sibling, Alexios. He's as good as us already. We need to look to the future. No. Go after him. Now, if you'll excuse me.
It's only blood right now. But who knows? Vemos may ask for our hands next. Go on, go on. Make your offering. I'll pass. The blood is for the cause, not the girl. Make your sacrifice. Oh. Sorry. We just have to keep our sights on what the bloodline will do for us. The bloodline? The mother, the father, the brother. You know, her kin. We need them. All of them. To use them? That information is not for Demos, of course. You know how volatile she is. She could rip through us easily. I'll be sure to keep it to myself. As you should. Nor can she know we're about to capture her mother. <laughs> and do what with her? I would lower my voice if I were you. Just know she will be put to good use. Unless she's uncontrollable. You know where she is? No. But it won't be long until we do, I assure you. She's the cult's next target. Tell me about Vimos. She's shown us what we need to know. She's a machine, a weapon for the cult. Someone that unstable can't be trusted with such personal information. I have to go. To our great ambition. To ambition. It's strange. I feel something towards the pyramid. It's covered in shards, like Alpinors. Ah, you had the last piece. Now it is ready. Every time I see it, it calls to me and sings of power. Does it call to you like it calls to me? It does. It's impressive. Yes. Show your reverence. What we have now is everything. Ira has blessed me. My great warrior is leading our army to victory. Can you imagine the pride I feel? Our champion will destroy our enemies before they even think to kneel. Mark my words. Elpinor is dead. One of you is a traitor. The artifact will expose them. You! <laughs> Everyone will be tested. You first. Go. You. Go.
you. Now that right there should have thrown you guys for a real loop. So it ends up our sister is still alive and we don't know how exactly she was able to survive as a baby from that fall. So both of us survived from that fall. Oh, you're alive. There were people in the temple. I couldn't see their faces. They... Herodotus. They control all of the Greek world. Everything. I see. It's worse than I thought. There's more. They have a weapon. What kind? A soldier. Stronger and more ferocious than any I've ever seen. Herodotus, it's my sister. We need to get to Athens. Athens? We need to find my mother. My clothes. Spear. Uh, of course. My spear! The cult of Cosmos called my sister, Lemos. She used an artifact to see my memories. Alexios, the man I serve, we must tell him what's happened before it's too late. You've heard the name Pericles before. Pericles is the great general leading the Thelian League against the Spartans. They say he's ruthless. We aren't leading the League against anyone. Pericles is a man of peace. This war was thrust upon him. Upon us all. A general who doesn't want war? Not likely. Save your doubts. He is working to end this war. We all are. If there are forces colluding against him, he must be warned. We have to go. You weren't there, Herodotus. The cult controls everything. There's no stopping them. Which is why you cannot turn away. They want to destroy all of the Greek world with this war. I won't be some pawn in your scheme, Herodotus. Don't do it for me, then. Do it for your mother. If there is one place where we can find information about your mother, it is in Athens. How? Pericles surrounds himself with the brightest minds in Athens, which is to say anywhere. In Athens, you can fulfill your duty to your family. Hmm. But before we can go, 
I need you to meet me at the Lion of Leonidas, at Thermobile. Leonidas? Why? There's something I need to know. Something that may help us take down this cult, and save your mother. You've proven I can trust you. But let's make it quick, Hirothothos. First to Romopoli, then we go to Athens. I'll make sure every single one of these cultists dies by my hands. All right, there you go. Now we have the cult available to us. These are different targets that we can take out, just like mercenaries. So we can attract them, we can eliminate them. As you can see, we've already taken out two. And in the center of it all, the chosen one. And we know who it is. The cult is nothing without me. Even the gods cower in my wake. Kneel or die. She's a level 35, so all you gotta do is click on the ones. You can see the white ones. Those are the ones that we can actually unveil because we've learned some things about them in the previous section. So you can open up their details, find out where they are, go do what you need to do to go about killing them. But we're not quite up there just yet. Um, but soon, obviously, we will be. We've just leveled up, so we have one more ability point that we can do. So let's see what we're going to put it into. Uh, we can't do Weapon Master anymore. We still can't upgrade. Spartan Kick. Progress further in the story. We're going to have to sign on to something completely new. We do have new options here. Beast Master. Contained. You can tame knock out wolves. So you can get them to fight on your side. Oh, that's a nice one. It's a hunter ability. Archery master. Ring of chaos. Increased armor. Flaming attacks. I think we're going to go with the Ring of Chaos. This uh, will definitely help us get people out of the way. And there's auto critical assassinations. 200% assassin damage. That's probably the best thing you want. Single strike attack unleashing the full power of the spear. I think we're going to go with the critical assassination. Hold Y for a critical. All right. It looks like we ran right into a mission. This is a this is a fairly good mission too. Um, we're not going to be doing it the way that I did it in my Let's Play though, because we're playing a male character. So, will the hurts go away? Tell you what, you have to scare it away. If you roar like a lion, it'll run. Good job. Now run along home. You must be a physician. Yes, I'm Lycaon. You must be a Mystheus. Are you here for treatment? That depends. Will I have to roar for you too? Sometimes the best medicine I can give my patients is a dose of hope. I take it you're not in need of care. I'm healthy as a horse. You look strong and prepared for anything. My patients need mandrake herbs. 
There's a pot of them growing by a little stream southeast of here. Are you too busy to pick them? Too chewy. A pack of wolves is resting near the stream. I'll pay you generously for your trouble. You know how to talk to Amistios. Is that all you want? The mandrake herbs? For now. Bring them back to me, and I'll pack at them for my patients. Then we'll see. I'll bring you the herbs. You said they were southeast of here? Yes. By a little stream northeast of Kira. The flowers haven't bloomed yet, but the leaves are a distinctive gray-green. Thank you. All right, so it looks like we need to actually set the mission since it didn't show up. Now this one can actually be a little tough because you're going to have to fight off a pack of wolves here. And there is a lot of wolves that will start attacking you. Get as many as you can before the fact, and you should be a little bit better. Now, unfortunately, we don't have any more, so... Gotta refill our inventory. Cowan said the herbs would be near a little stream. That looks like it. You'll see that we have a better opportunity at taking on these wolves one at a time than we do if we had five of them all attacking as a wolf. These must be the herbs the Cowan wanted. Alright, so now we're just gonna go up and down the stream. This should be enough mandrake herbs. Time to go back to the physician. Now again, that can cause you a lot of problems if you don't specifically take out some of those wolves quickly or else you're going to be facing five of them at the same time and on hard mode we will die super quick. Found your herbs. Thank you. I'll prepare these for my patients. Could you please stay a while? I'll wait. I've crossed the herbs so they'll be easier to take. Could you please bring them to my patients? Just tell them they're for me, Likaun. I thought I brought you more herbs than this. I needed to save a double dose for my grandmother. I'll give it to her soon. Sure. I'll just deliver the rest then. Thank you. All my patients are in and around the Hora of Delphi. One should be at the animal pens to the west. One is building a house in the northeastern corner. And uh, one works in the fields to the south. Come back here when you're done. I'm sure I can find them. Out of the way. 
These herbs are from Likaon. Oh, thank you. That physician is so thoughtful and so handsome. It's too bad he's decided not to marry. Why not? He just told me some nonsense about not wanting to burden an innocent woman with his worries. Personally, I just wish he'd been honest and said I'm not his type. Huh. I wonder why he'd say that. Likaon made this medicine for you. Thanks. See, I take care of these beasts, and Likaon takes care of me. Too bad nobody takes care of him, though. What do you mean? His parents died young. His grandmother raised him, but then... she was born under a cursed star. Never mind that. He's a good boy. I'm sure he is. <laughs> Likaon sends his regards. The medicine he promised. Thank you. Tell me, did he look well? He didn't look sick to me. I've seen him up and walking around at all hours, mumbling to himself. He seems worried. I should bring him some sweets to cheer him up. I'm sure he'd appreciate that. I delivered all your medicine. Seems you have a lot of people concerned for your well-being. Thanks. Um... My grandmother, Praxithea, I have to bring her the last of the medicine. Will you come along with me to her house? I think I need your help. Yes. I'd like to know what's going on here. Oh, thank you. Please, my grandmother's house is this way. Thanks for coming with me. Why do you ask me that? If someone is impious to the point of doing grave injustice to people as well as the gods, do they not deserve punishment? What did Praxithea do? She spoke false prophecies for years. Those who came to her for advice received only lies. Your grandmother was an oracle? Yes, up on the hill in Delphi. She confessed to me recently that she never had the gods and only repeated the words she was told. Told by vile people with evil intentions. Exactly. Wars have been fought over those words. She can't be left unpunished. I... My family was torn apart by a false prophecy. If it was one of hers, I may take matters into my own hands. I know what you want to do. You'll just bring more shame on our family. I don't want to do this, Agavi. But for the sake of justice, we can't let Praxithea live. It's out of our hands anyway. Some strange men were searching the village today, looking for her. I brought them here, and they dragged her away. What kind of justice is that? You wouldn't understand. She was an impious old fool. Now we have nothing more to worry about. Who are you anyway? I'm Alexios. I've also been wronged by a false prophecy. It might have been your grandmother's. If we don't find her, we can't settle any of this. Please help me figure out where she's been taken. I'll look for clues. What did you expect me to do? All that talk about killing? Absolutely. Have you seen anything strange going on around here? Well, if bandits taking over my cousin's farm is strange, yes. What did they do? Gave her a running start. She can't go back there. They've set up camp, and they're armed and dangerous. Interesting. Where is that farm? It's not far west of here. But I wouldn't mess with those bandits. Thanks for the advice. That wasn't the way it was supposed to happen. She's my responsibility, not yours. Praxithea must have lost this bracelet in the struggle. But no ordinary thief would have left something so valuable behind. This looks like a contract. 
Deliver the package to the drop-off, and don't damage it. If they mean Likaun's grandmother, chances are she's alive. Praxithia was kidnapped and brought to a farm west of here. The bandits were hired to deliver her alive. Thank you for figuring that out, Alexios. I'm no fool, Likaun. Your sister put Praxithia in great danger, and you've been asking me about killing. Do you want me to end her life? No. It has to be me. I need to kill her. She's your grandmother, and you're no killer. You should give this more thought. She's my responsibility. I don't want her to suffer. That's why I asked you for Mandrake. It's a painkiller. But for now, will you go to the farm to stop those bandits? I don't think I can take them all on myself. Let's go find Praxithia. Thanks, Alexios. You said the farm was to the west. I'll meet you there. Onward! Off we go. Come on. I wasn't expecting to have to fight off these guys. Must be the farm where Praxathea is being held prisoner. All right, let's go take care of business. Try to stay out of sight.
Get me out! You saved me! Thank you, Mistios! Must get away from here. Could more bandits be coming? Please, let's get out of here. Thank you for saving me, dear child. Don't thank me, voice of Apollo. Or were those someone else's words you spoke? So you've met my grandson. You're right. I lied to everyone. I am so sorry. The gods should have killed me by now. Instead, they made me live with my remorse. Why did you spread lies? People trusted you. You were supposed to bring them the word of Apollo. I didn't plan to, not when I was chosen to be the oracle of Apollo. But I met people there who told me I must speak the words they asked, or else my family would suffer for my disobedience. Family? Do you remember telling a Spartan family that their younger child must die? A grieving mother with eyes like mine. I am so sorry for what you have lost. Who wanted you kidnapped? These brutes didn't come up with the idea themselves. Please, don't ask me that. The ones who want to punish me now, the ones who told me what to say, they would bury you alive if I told you about them. The ones with masks and dark cloaks? The cult of Cosmos? Do not speak their name. Grandmother. Did she tell you? Is she the oracle who brought ruin on your family? I'm sorry for what I've done. I accept my punishment. But please, don't let my grandson kill me. Likaon's a good man, a healer. This would break him. No, this is my responsibility. I must be the one to end her. I've killed enough people to know that violence has no end. Better to move on and make the best of the lives the gods have given you. Move on? But you said Praxithea ruined your family. She can do no more harm. Killing her for revenge won't change what happened. Besides, didn't you tell me something about hope? Thank you for your mercy. I promise I will do good with what's left of my days. You're right, Alexios. I might not be able to forgive my grandmother, not right away. But she can go on with her life, and I with mine. I think you've made the right decision, Nikaon. Oh, how do you do this? Decide who lives and who dies. How do you do it, Likaon? All those lives depending on you, needing your healing and kindness. I... I think I need you, Alexios. Not to kill anybody or find anything. Just to stay with me. I'm no healer, but I think you've been through a lot, Likaon. You don't need a Mistios in your life. Go back home and be the physician you were meant to be. All right, there we go. Helm of Prophecy. We have completed the Unkindest Cult. That was actually three quick missions right in a row, as you can see. So we got some good XP points. The next uh, mission up is a level 13. But there's actually no real fighting in it, so it doesn't really matter. But we're going to save that for the next video. I've had a pleasure of playing this for all of you guys, and hopefully you all have been enjoying as well. I've had a blast. You can see how vulnerable the Athenian leadership is here. But we haven't even discovered their leader yet. But that doesn't really matter. But we're not going to get into that right now. The next thing that we're going to be doing, uh, eventually we're going to be going into this mission right here. So maybe we'll do that in the next video. I think you guys enjoy that. Um, love you guys. Take care of yourselves. Please let me know how the uh, quality was. 
uh, below so I know what to fix, what to change around, or anything like that. Please take care of yourselves, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out.